till like four in the morning. Um, and some sound dude at the show started saying really sketchy shit. So like, Mikey and Matt got into it with him a little, and then we just like fucking peeled up out of town. I, it wasn't so yeah. much that we got into it, but it was just kind of like, okay, this so, kind of you, you're terrible. I want to leave now. Okay. Yeah. But then we like got into the van and then just left. Um, and well, like, he was just fanning too hard over Matt, which is fucking weird. Also not uncommon. I was. I didn't require a fan. I was very chilly already. And it just kind of, I feel like I got a little sick and all that fanning. They had a cold front, it was like 75 degrees. <laughs> so we just like started heading out towards San Antonio and we didn't look out the drive distance beforehand. We just kind of like looked at a map of the US and we were like, that doesn't that's look too the, far. That's where those things are at. And so we just- They're, they're uh, much closer on the map than in real life. Peeled out of town, spent like <coughs> three and a half hours on the road, pulled over at a gas station that apparently had a tiger outside, or formerly a tiger, Tony the tiger. It just recently died, though, but they hadn't had the heart to remove the cage. Um, they, like, slept on the floor of the van, woke up, left out from there. It was really cool. We played this spot at like a uh, like a, a restaurant. It was like this uh, Mexican food place, and I'm gonna screw up the name, so I'm not even gonna say it. Just have it sit kind of somewhere up here. Uh, it was El Chilaquila. No, because it didn't have the A on the back of it. Those slow pegs were the shit. It wasn't Chilaquila. It was, it was like Chilaquil, shit. and like I'm like, but oh! that sounds weird when I say that. Look my teeth. Hmm. We got there and we're. Immediately greeted by Luke from the FLQs, who was very interested in talking. Waited until White Zombie was done, and then we just got everybody's dress bands and then put, like slipped them on and then got it. So that was cool. I think they just did a day um, in Indiana the week prior, uh, so we'd seen them a little bit there, and then just ended up meeting together down there in Texas. Uh, Yoli set up the show. I think I uh, knew them. It's the drummer from Medusa. I uh, actually got the spot, but when we walked in, okay. it was weird because they were like in the middle of dinner service. It was like eight o'clock, and there was like just a bunch of families. And Yoli was like, "Oh yeah, just go ahead and like load in your gear. We're getting set in now." So like, you kind of figured like, "Oh okay, the show starts at eight. People are gonna start thinning out." So we kind of like went and grabbed beer and cigarettes, uh, just talked with people, got to know people, but like it wasn't thinning out. And then it was like nine thirty, and we we're like. Okay, well, like, they've been closed for, like, a half hour. These people are probably going to, like, leave soon because they have their food. And then, like, they didn't. And by the time the bands actually started playing, they had to take the microphone and be like... Have you played in a restaurant before? Uh, if you're not here for the show, I'm sorry. So it was just, like, middle-aged couples and, like, Famous. parents with kids just, like, eating dinner. <clears throat> and then just punks having a show. 
on the opposite side of the venue, which honestly was a fantastic moment. I loved every bit of how painfully awkward that that was, but everyone was super cool about it. Uh, Medusa had an awesome set. Like, I didn't know anything about Medusa before we went in. Uh, so that was pretty astounding to see. Sun Attack was good. Um, it's the band with David in it. We play a lot of San Antonio. Uh, we've only done two tours so far. Uh, we did, we've did. just done two Midwest tours. It seems pretty cool. Uh, we've have, we've, there's a lot more bands coming up. Uh, I'm doing a couple projects. Josh is doing a couple other projects. Uh, it's just something that will give us a year and we'll see new bands. I learned another band called Death Cult. Uh, put that plug in. In the way of like us, like we've only started two bands together. Uh, Medusa's been in two bands. A third project. Oh, they're gonna do a third project? No, no, we're gonna do a third project. Well, okay, okay, yes, there, there is some. I shouldn't say it on camera because I hate him. <laughs> I like you a lot. Exactly. <laughs> Documentation of me saying I like you. I know. Oh, keep you hate it, me? Oh, what's this? Thank yeah. you to everybody that's been really kind to us and helped set up the show and like cared enough to come up and say hi and like introduce yourself. That means the world. Uh, positivity aside, we're super negative people, so let's get started with this. <laughs> Yeah, we played. Yeah, I ate a sope, and it was like, it looked the size of a pancake. Actually, sopes are uh, very small. It was very big, and I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Uh, I could definitely see myself going back there and getting another sope. Let's do it. And uh, and I wouldn't care if there was a punk truck going on or not. I wouldn't make him stop. I would just keep eating my sope. It would, like, it would be kind of annoying. But I think that I could do it. It was very colorful in that in that place too. I had the taco dinner. It was really cool. Uh, I had the taco drank dinner. Drank some beers there too. They I sold the beer. Dinner. So, uh, yeah, that show was awesome. Um, it was really cool. FLQs was great. Everyone from I Man Out was super nice. It was nice to get to talk to them. Um, I feel like we're maybe getting ahead of ourselves here again. Should we mention the cool guy, or should we not? Fuck the cool guy. Yeah. Don't fucking bump cigarettes from people. If you mention the cool guy, you just make try to act cool. cool. Like, He's gonna be like and then ride past them in a motorcycle. That doesn't make you look cool. It's just a jerk. You're giving that cool guy too much play. Yeah, cut that out. Yeah, cut me out. Replace me with the dog. <clears throat> so that was it. You know, went pretty good. It, there was three touring bands. Um, was it two or three locals? Two, two locals, right? Two. Medusa and... Um, Medusa and Sun Attack. Yeah. No. Oh. There's three locals. There's only two touring bands. No, there's three. three. FLQ, three. I Man Out and Us. Oh, I forgot about FLQ. Yeah. Nice. No, there's, there, there was three, uh, three local bands, yeah. Yeah, three local bands. And then I can't remember the name of the first band. They Shout were young. They were good. Shout out to David for hooking it up with the show. Yes. And... and who that, I don't know who set up that show anymore. Who knows? Well, then we went and hung out at the Medusa house. Yeah, we went. Now it's tight. We can't over there forget that porch. guy. That guy's worth a mention. Someone else say it. I don't want to keep talking. There's so much shit to say. Like, we've been talking about it the whole way, like, way down here, too. Like, every time something happens, we talk about it. And then we're, like, trying to, like, <coughs> all together. Yeah, we'll just do intro clips. Uh, here's a drunk guy uh, singing at people. And my dreams are not coming to you. What to do? That's a, it's a bluesy, it's a bluesy. I'm doing it, it sound good. It hey, sounds good. I mean, your neighbor, by the way. I live here. Oh, okay. All right, I'll do it on that. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they don't live here anymore. Oh, they don't? Nah. Oh, shit, I got more, I'm all invading and shit. Sounds like it. Sorry about it. Sorry about it.